Hi, once again this is uh, Raju with an another uh, video and in this video we are going to discuss about how to change the default keyboard shortcuts assigned for a command in in a graphics. In general as you know for the commands which we use more often when we work with the softwares will be assigned with the keyboard shortcuts and uh, now let us see how we can modify those keyboard shortcuts or even uh, if the shortcut keyboard shortcut command is not assigned to a particular command we will we can even assign the keyboard uh, shortcuts by ourselves and let us see how we can do this let us consider an example as shown here here i have a sketch for which i want to create an extrude since we use extrude very often and it uh, there has been a shortcut command for extrude it is you can see as you click on this drop down you can see the X is the shortcut which is designed for the extrude command. So if you want to invoke this extrude command, you can just press X from your keyboard. As I just pressed X, you can see the extrude uh, window has opened here. Now I can just select the sketch and I can create the extrude. Just let me cancel this. Now I am going to change this X into some other keyboard shortcut. And let us see how to do that. So go to menu and under tools, click on customize or you can directly press ctrl 1 which is the shortcut keyboard shortcut for invoking this customize window just click customize and here let me choose this shortcut command and here I can just scroll down and choose keyboard and where we have uh, here we have this extrude command under the insert insert and under the insert you can click on design feature and here you can see under the design feature whatever the commands are there you can see all these commands are listed here and when I click on extrude, you can see the shortcut key is assigned for that is X here. So let me just select this shortcut command and I can click on remove. That particular command uh, shortcut keyboard has been removed for extrude. And let me just enter the new shortcut key which I want to assign. Let me say B here. And here we have option as global and application only. Let us discuss about this option uh, later. And let me choose application only. And I can click on assign. And you can see b has been assigned for this extrude and used in only this application that is only this command will only work in modeling application once it is assigned you can just click ok and you can close this customize window now just press b in your key from your keyboard you can see the extrude window has been invoked so this way we can modify the default assigned uh, keyboard shortcuts in UG, in in graphics so let me cancel and let me just press once again press the B from my keyboard and you can see the extrude window has been invoked and let me just select this particular sketch and say okay we have created the extrude and in order if you want to cross verify whether the keyboard shortcut has been assigned you can just by clicking on B by pressing B and you can check or even again once again if you just move your cursor near the extrude command you can see uh, B has been mentioned in the bracket it means that the B key, uh, Key B has been assigned to X to invoke the extrude toolbar, extrude window. In this way, any shortcut command has been uh, can be customized in your in your graphics. And let us just once again go back and check this. Or, or let me just say, Control One is the shortcut. I just press Control One so that you can see the customized window here. Let me click on keyboard. And here you can see in, in, in any of the options, whatever the commands you, we use in our uh, uh, software, you can just click on those commands and you can see is there any commands has been applied, uh, has been assigned. This way you can uh, just check whatever the shortcut command has been uh, assigned. Uh, say for example, for taking a section view, the keyboard shortcut does control H. So you can just select, you can remove and you can assign a new keyboard shortcut for that. And here you can see this, is, this control H has been applied for as a as a global parameter. Now the difference between the application only and the global option is when you select the application only, uh, when you represent it will be applicable only for the present model. Say for example, when if you are in a modeling mode, modeling mode, and if you as in a shortcut, and if you say application only, that particular keyboard shortcut will work only in modeling mode. When you say global, the same the this the assigned keyboard shortcut will be uh, will work both in modeling in any of the model, both in modeling and uh, assembly or even it can be a drafting. 
commands for example let us just consider a command which we commonly use in all these modules say for example let me go for a file and let me click on close and here for all parts for closing all parts there is no keyboard shortcut assigned and let us assign a keyboard shortcut here so let me say M and since M has been applied already for modeling I cannot use M let me say K here and you can see this K has not been assigned to any command so I can assign it for this and here let me choose global and let me click on assign and you can see the key as K has been applied globally to close all these parts and let us close and let me close and here I have a model and let me just create a let me open the drawing of this particular model too so under window I have just the, uh, I have kept the drawing file open so let me click on drawing under the application so I need to click on drafting so that the drafting mode is active now you can see this is where I have the drawing file now let us just try to press the shortcut uh, keyboard key which we have assigned for closing all parts if I just press K from my keyboard you can see it is asking to close all files and let me just cancel and let me go back to the part model uh, modeling mode so this is the modeling mode and once again let me press K here you can see again it is asking for close all files so now K, since I have assigned this keyboard shortcut K as global shortcut you can see it has been working in modeling also and it is working in the drawing mode also and in order to verify that again once again you can click on file close and under all parts you can see the shortcut k has been assigned to close this all parts so this way we can assign keyboard shortcuts to commands or even you can modify the default shortcuts has been assigned to any command here in unigraphics and here let us just cross cross verify for b also here for x to the shortcut command what we uh, assigned is b and it is working in a part model so just I pressed B and it is opening the part, uh, extrude window and let us go back to drawing window and let us check whether this uh, B invokes extrude command or not and here we are in a drawing module and let me just press B here and I am pressing B see you can see there is no extrude command is invoking so this the command B since we applied only for Pot module it will work only in the pot module it will not work in the drawing module so this is the difference when you assign a keyboard shortcut globally or only for application so when you apply for globally it works in all the modules and you have to assign this shortcut only for the commands which is used in all these modules and uh, when you apply the keyboard shortcut only for one application it will work only in that particular application uh, and that's it thanks for watching